Alrighty guys, we only got one more area to go. Yeah, this is the last one before we next one. Rumor has it that Florence, the Benevadon of Wood, is awake. Yeah, my friends won't know if something's wrong if they're all asleep. Oh yes, they won't know. Look at the big flowers again. The flowers are big, aren't they? Uh, let's go. I mean, make sure you understand how big those flowers really are. Oh, this does not look good. Where'd this feather come from? It's big, too big. A benevadon, perhaps? Yes. Oh no, they're gone. Everyone was eaten. J Julie. The benevadon of wood. It attacked, ate everyone. I, I can feel their fear soaked into the soil. Does that yeah. mean the sproutlings are? No, I, I think they're okay. We're interconnected, so I know. But we have to look around for clues as to where the Benevadon went. All right, so this area is a disaster zone. Okay, we understand that. And see if there are any clues about that Benevadon. Uh, Prince might know, but. We'll see how we go. Okay, Dorid. Di oh my, they're all here. That is good to see. If I had more power, the Sproutlings wouldn't have... Would it be? At least you're safe, Dryad. What... What in the goddess's name happened here? Lore it happened, simply put. It was just after the attack on the sanctuary. The Benevadon of Wood swooped down from the sky and... No. Lorit flew, ate all of the Sproutlings, and then fled the burrow. So that's it? All the Sproutlings were like that? Oh, no, no, no. What made you think that? They were swallowed, roots and all. They should still be alive. Oh, oh, right. Well, that's good then. Where did Flora take them? You can't leave. Oh no, you mustn't go after them. That's why we came back. To show some Benevidons who's boss. And of course I promised to Coda. I can't let Flora make off with my friends and eat their buds at its leisure. We are here to protect the burrow? You came all the way back for us? That's yes. Honest, not just for you. We're here to save the whole world from getting yanked around by those Benevidon bullies. You lay. You have grown so much. Uh, really? It's hard to tell. I don't feel any taller. Whatever. Can you tell us where to look? I thought what she meant. I that I could, but I have no idea where Floret was headed. I am so sorry. Uh, but perhaps you could ask Trent. He keeps an eye on everything, including the skies. Good idea. Okay, everyone. New plan. We're going to the sanctuary entrance to talk to Trent. <laughs> yep. Trent All right. Trent time. The entrance to the sanctuary. Here's hoping he has some information on Florit. Got some syrup. Um, let's go and find one of those fast traveling things and fast travel there. All right. All right. All right. I'm feeling a bit fatigued tonight, guys. I don't know why. Here we go. Alright, fast travel to Bridge Frank is. Um Go there. Talk to Trent. Trent will tell us where to go and we can do that. Um I think we've got to do a quest for him though. Trent's been a big help to our group, huh? One day we will find a way to show our appreciation well. Guys, remember what I said earlier that was a catless we missed? I think I found it. Not tear somewhere, but where? Oh, green.
It's not this way. It's obviously over here somewhere. Aha! There he is! That's the catalyst I missed! That's one at the very end, and then we'll be right. Alright, so that was the one I missed. Oh, it's lucky, guys. I don't know how I found that one by accident. Uh huh. Let's talk to Trent and see what we can do. Trent doesn't look very well. He looks sick. Trent, you awake? Oh, Julie. the weather i was resting my eyes oh are you sick do not worry so little sprout it is merely a reaction to denophos's curse gaining ground in these parts that's not as comforting as you might think my friend it is a simple plight such illnesses pass with the time and <laughs> Alright, I'll have to fix him up before we do anything, guys. Oh man, I need a new chair, guys. The chair's. Trent? Hello? Every time I lean yeah. back, my chair just caves in. I need a new chair. The sanctuary would be down a goddess and an overseer. Trent brought up a blight, I believe. Might we make for Lagrazzo to mention this to Master Aish? I happen to have asked Aish about horticulture on a past visit to the archives. He may have a hunch that we could follow to its conclusion. Oh, thanks, Palomina. Aish's weird obsession with research might be good for something for a change. Be right back, Trent. Gotta make a pit stop at Lagrazzo. <laughs> Light, huh? All right, let's go to Dale. friend in Lagrazzo can help. It pains me to admit it, but we can always count on Aish to have ideas. Yeah, hang in there, Trent. Yeah, I don't know if they're always good ideas. That's the difference. Once we do this, guys, we can get to the next area, beat the boss, and then we can finally do the last one. So we should be near the end of the game. The, the most boring bits will be occurring. Uh, go over here. So side quests are going to take forever, but. There's something that we need to do. I have noticed the game doesn't crash no more. Um, I obviously think they fixed a the bug. I've seen an update or two come out on it a few times. Well, I think twice. After it crashed last time, so I think they fixed it finally. All right, let's go. Go talk to Ish, Ash, Ish, whatever his name is. All right, let's get there. All right, we're here. Not that way. Uh huh. You know this place was in such a messy hellhole. Alright, oh, there he is. What an unexpected visit! Have you dispatched with the Benevidons already? Not quite. We're looking for a cure for tree blight. Trent isn't doing well after all this Dalefos kerfuffle. He caught something bad, but we need his help finding another Benevidon. Say no more. I'm flattered that you would turn to me in your hour of need. Dare I say we have become fast friends? Fear not. I have no intention of disappointing you, Jule. I possess a plant that alleviates the exact symptoms you described. That's good news. We That's a guy. I'm just going to sit back like this. Flower in Lagrazzo. Its nectar replenishes several crucial nutrients in plants, revitalizing perennial growth. 
The nectar? That'll make Trent better? Huh. Well, I guess all I can say is thanks, Aish. You really came through. Wonderful. Your investigation of agricultural advancements has vastly improved since my last inquiry. Why, yes, Palomina. In fact, it was your question about the adaptive properties of plants in connection to their natural habitats that sparked my interest in the field. You see, first I created a closed testing area there we go. to control the environmental influences on the organisms in order to isolate the... Okay, that's enough gabbing for one day. You should know that it was your foray against Rathlevine and Verdius that inspired this particular plant. Wait, how did you even hear about that fight? You weren't there. True, but the Merchant Sisters were. They were kind enough to fill me in on your burrow exploits, which in turn rekindled my interest in the nectar. Von Voyage played quite an integral role in its cultivation as well. And now an opportunity to test our crop has fortuitously emerged. The people here really do experiment on anything and everything, huh? Gardening isn't even a thing here in Legrato. Such is a scholar's natural inclination. Our curiosity knows no bounds, and our attention wanders to whatever happens to intrigue us. Hmm, inquisitive types, huh? <laughs> in any case, you really saved our buds this time. Let's deliver this medicine to Trent. Yep, and then Trent will tell us where to go. Okay, guys, I'm seeing like this. I don't care. I, I think this is more relaxing. Good luck Let's take it nice and easy. Expedition. Let's get a new chair, guys. Let's get a new chair that's a stronger back. I shouldn't need to do this. Never doubted Ish for a second. We gotta get this back to Trent. All right, so let's get out of here. Um, we don't need to be here, do we? No, we don't. Where to next? Yeah. <sighs> Still got dinner to have, guys. I haven't even had it yet. Usually I have it before I stream, but today I just didn't feel like it. I'm slowly getting hungry now. But slowly being the key word. This is me, guys. Uh, who's messaging me? All right, let's go. All right, we're here, I think. Yep, great. Let's drop it in. Much easier to play a game when it doesn't crash. Another case solved by Aish. He'll never let us lift this dome. If it helps, I bet he doesn't even realize how condescending he can sound. Yeah, but he doesn't do it on purpose. of darkness for something to help with plant blights. Here you go. Oh, you have my thanks, Julie. Alms. A peculiar taste. Why, I feel like a brand new shoot, full of energy. How oh, marvelous. Oh, good. I wasn't entirely sure it was trustworthy. Ouch. Oh. To think that you would come to my aid. <sighs> you have another gravely important duty on your shoulders. Now, I didn't say this medicine was free. We need answers, and you're just the tree to give them to us. We have to seal away the benevolent on the wood after what it did to Verdius. But we don't know where it went. So that is what you are after. Unfortunately, I have not seen hide nor feather of a Benevodon since the assault on the Sanctuary. However, I do have a guess. A plan.
man's purpose is to take root, flower, fruit, and grow. Floret may be intending to do the same. For that, it needs sproutlings. More precisely, it needs the wood manor that resides within the flower folk. Unfortunately, collecting sproutlings will not yield the crop it seeks. That's why it ate them? I believe there is more to its method than simply consuming the sproutlings. The Benevadon also needs a suitable location to germinate. There is but one place with a connection to the mystic realm suitable for growing its seedlings. The floating isle of Orul. Floating? So, the isle is in the sky? How do we get there? I don't know, we fly? Dummy! Now that Ramco's powers have been unleashed, we can go anywhere we want. Ground, sky, wherever. <laughs> That's right! How could I forget about Ramco? Alms, as the Overseer, I can but watch your exploits from afar. But you have my sincerest wishes for your victory. Trust me, we want the victory as well. That's enough for us, Trent. Oh, better get going. We have a flight to catch. Ouch, okay, that's one way of saying it. Guys, sorry guys, we're thinking about relaxing like this because it's easier to play. Floating Isle. What are we getting ourselves into this time? There are too many unknowns. All we can do is assess whether our assortment of items is adequate. Alright, so what we're gonna do now, guys, is go to the next area. That's where uh, we're gonna go. This is the last new area that we can unlock, so. Now the only difference now, guys, is some areas we have unlocked, but we haven't unlocked it completely, but we can access them. So, yeah. Now, this is the last one. We can access this. We're pretty much going to access go almost anyway. God damn it. Alright, let's go here. Alright, this one's going to be fun. So, yeah, once we find everything, guys, we'll be able to Make our way up. It's hard to maintain my, my my energy just sitting up like this. It drains so much energy. I think it's what happens when you get a bit lazy. This place is what remains of the mystic realm after it was conjoined to the mortal. When Pedia was created, a single island from the mortal realm floated into the sky. It's still there to this day. It is a beautiful, strange place. But don't let your guards down. Now I've seen friggin insects. Floating bits of land? Better not tell the folks down below. This is what the home realm of the Benevidons looked like? Huh. It's chilling in more ways than one. Get the mud out, people! Lord's still at large, so don't waste too much time on small fry. Hmm. Perfect. All right, we're here, guys. This is a new area. It's a nice area, but a new area. Let's get going. Around here. We should keep going. Um, we don't really need to fight these, but I'm going to. I'm just going to go like this. Excuse me, I'm going to fight you guys since we're here. I mean, they're not really going to give me much, but... They're actually giving me nothing at all. They're not even worth doing it to. Oh well. We'll just come here, collect what we need to collect, and get out. So how many of you said? 20 chests and 8 of them. Okay, so this is a big area. big in the experience department but almost there guys one more fight and we should be in the next level department I don't think it really matters if we go that way or not um these guys on the other hand uh. all right we're at next level guys 
good mood, Ramco. She flew a long way. My guess is she's preening after a job well done. <laughs> Alright, that one. Um, disregard. Get it. Move on. Don't worry about fighting enemies. It's still not worth battling, to be honest. At least some of them aren't. These guys on the other hand are. Where is it? It's down here, I guess. Oh, there it is. I think that's a chest. This is kind of exciting. This might be useful. Uh huh. It's something this way. Grizzly. Where? I don't see anything. I don't see anything at all. Oh wait, it's on the side. Yeah, I know where it is. It's behind this tree. This is kind of exciting. This might be useful. Go back that way. All right, let's go. I don't need to deal with that. I've done this area pretty well. Let's go back up and start getting to the new area. That's not here, so. It's up there, okay. There's also one this way. Probably up there as well, so okay, we're getting there. Find our way up. Pretty much yes. This is kind of is this? All right, go this way now. There should be yep, there it is. Have one. I'm just gonna wander around, guys, collecting this stuff. That's it. This shouldn't take long. May this momentum motivate us. All right. Oh, that's the other one. Oh shit, I almost fell off the edge completely in the arm. That's that one over there. What's this one then? One over here somewhere. Over there maybe? I don't know. It's here somewhere. That's all I know. Oh, it's headed over there. Only imagine the interest H would have in what we are experiencing. It'd be a constant. Alright, let's get that, let's get this. Keep moving on guys, we're not gonna get much. Thanks for the pick me up. Oh yeah, we're doing pretty well guys. I mean how long have we been on for an hour and a half, so it's not that bad. Well I can say for another hour I'll be happy. Oh, wait, there's a ch there's a chest over here. Let me see. Is this? All right, we're almost Let there, guys. See. Now we can go this way because it's now it's mostly a straight line. Hey, what's the point of hoarding all this looter if you're not gonna 
These smell similar to the plant life on the Lucia Isle. Indeed. The flora and fauna of the Mystic Realm heavily resemble that of the Sanctuary. We can probably cross this gap using the powers of the wood elemental. Yep. Help us out. Take it away. All right, let's go. Alright. Let me see. Let's kick on, guys. Much more to do now. I mean, most of these. Is that all of them? Uh, are we still fighting? That's what I thought. We're getting a good experience, guys. We are level 90... 94. At least the secret boss I'll be able to beat easily. Actually, I might be able to do him very soon, maybe even in this video. Got the other way, dude. That's the other one. Of course you are. Let's uh, explore. Hey guys. Alright. Maybe, but I won't count on it. Up we go. I can't remember if there's a side boss here. I don't think there is. But it could be. Oh, there yet? Oh, almost. All right, let's get going. Let's wait for that. Okay, good. Now we can go here. I should be using my items. Um, why not? I don't know why I'm not using it. Yes. Probably because I don't really need to, because none of these enemies are challenging. Okay, it's up there. Uh huh. So the Benevidons used to live together in peace here? Back when the flow of mana was freely functioning, yes. I doubt there was anything peaceful about it. They've never been a friendly bunch. Okay. Why can't I find any? Alright, there's one there. Uh, should be one over here somewhere. Yeah, there it is. Let me see. Nice. All right, we're getting there. How much we got left? We got nine chests to do and two more elemental things. Um, yeah, none of these guys are that strong.
That's not a nice thing to say about them, but... Let's go this way. Getting there, we're getting there. Where is it? There it is. But most of this area is pretty easy, guys. It just takes a while. Remember, like I said earlier, when we got here, this is a, a new area, so obviously I'll have to do pretty much the whole thing. Um, so the last new area we're gonna worry about because oh, let's get over here, collect all we want, get out. Alright, let's get going. So yeah guys, I don't normally stream this early, but I decided to do it today, because why not? I kind of want to get the game out the way as quickly as possible and enjoy it. I mean, I do enjoy it, but I'm playing it for nearly a month, according to my um, recording, so I think it's time to get this out the way. Yes, that's all. I mean, we've got a good amount of experience, guys. We're just not getting as much as I expected. That's true, I mean, they would... Alright, we've got this one now, we can go here. Um, what the hell? Alright guys, are we close to it? I think we are, I think it's just over there. 100 and... Well, okay, we'll be about 140 time we get there, but yeah, we'll be pretty clear close to it. Yep. Let me see. This might be useful. I was getting worried that might have been a trap. It wasn't really out the way or anything, so sometimes when they're not out the way, they can be traps. That one wasn't. Okay. Some more stuff up ahead. Are we nearly there? Um, yeah, okay. We're quite there, actually. Yeah, if I'm right, I think it's just in this area here. Taking this? No, I think this is another that boss. Or is it? Look at the feathers. They are the same as the one in Verdius. We know their origin. Where is the monster? 
Incoming! Okay, no, this is the boss. She's gonna use thunder on us. Alright. Yeah, but we're hurting it that much, it doesn't matter. Gotcha. Not very hard at all. Alright, we're pretty much there, guys. Now we've got done that one. We've got one more to go. Everyone, I did it. Lord is gone, and the Sproutlings of Verdius are in danger no longer. I seriously cannot get enough of this floating island, though. We can see all of Verdius. Oh, you can see the whole world from here. Huh, funny. I've never been anywhere but Verdius since the day I sprouted. Until the day I left on the pilgrimage, that is. I figured fate saw fit to grow me there. So, that's where I stayed. That was enough of a reason for me. But now, I know that life's there to experience. I don't always have to follow the rules. If I hadn't met you all, I probably would have been gobbled down just like my friends and accepted it as destiny. I don't want to sit down and take things without a fight anymore. And I'm glad you all made me realize it. Not to sound like a broken record, but thanks. Enough of that mushy stuff. You're welcome, okay? <laughs> Look at that. Karina's embarrassed. I can hardly hearken back to how Jule used to handle himself. The journey has had quite the effect on him. Karina, too. The more you see of the world, the more those experiences change you for the better. Not necessary. They can change you for the worse as well. It depends on the... We gotta get back to Verdius. Golly, Dryad's probably worried about us. Let's let her know we're okay. Hmm. Perfect. Yep, guys. We've still got a while yet. Now we got to do the fire one. So that's the last one, guys. The fire one. And then we got to do the... Getting to him, and then we do the side quest and all that stuff. That's a terrible song. That's a failure. Another banger from yours truly. Jam number one thousand five hundred fifty-nine is a hit. <gasps> a stellar performance, and I do mean both the song and your fight against the Benevaton. You're a hero in your own right! With you here, the other Sproutlings will feel much safer during their hibernation until the next song is chosen. That's the thing, Dryad. I've been doing a lot of thinking on this pilgrimage. The world keeps changing. And I think it's our job to adapt and keep up. Instead of putting down roots, I think the only way to grow is to get out there and mingle. I mean, at least it's a date. Then you mean, yeah, I think Sproutlings should give places other than the burrow a try. Branch out in a bunch of different locations. I know that traveling the world hasn't exactly been the Sproutling whale these years. But I think it might be my way. This is the future you've envisioned, Jule? Yep. Someone's got to take that first step, and I think it's me. If there's anything I've learned on this journey, it's that. Well, I think that's brave of you. Yes, quite brave and good. Huh. On that note, it's time for us to make like a tree and leaf. Oh, boy. To do, monsters to defeat. One. We've got one. composed just as the Alms arrived in Verdius. 
What? Jam number 1460? That's the one. Now, all of a sudden. I was indisposed when you first sang it. Don't you remember? It isn't fair that I'm the only one who hasn't heard your masterpiece. Well, if you insist. This one's a good one, though. since its debut i call this one jam number 1560 looks like i'll be touring all around the world oh god posing songs about my travels so look forward to more new tunes from me yeah i think she's kind of excited guys 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 it's been pretty quiet tonight at least now i know how to do To go to Tiania. This is the last one. We gotta make it count. Of course, it'll be the last one, but the first one we've seen. So this is the first area we could not go to for ages. Now we can go there anytime we want. Um. Yeah. Wow. I can scarcely believe my eyes. Master Fugo. Hmm. And your friends are. These are my companions, the members of this year's pilgrimage. We came back to the village to stop the Benevit on a fire before it's too late. Everybody, this is Fugo, a soul guard from back in the day. He mentored Liza and me when we were training for the job. It is a veritable honor to make your acquaintances, Alms. Perhaps the answer is evident, but I assume you have not yet completed your journey to the mana tree. Where is Hina? She... Hina is... I see. Dorfer has been particularly active recently. It seems I was right to fear the worst in regards to our dear home of fire. You mentioned a Benevidon has appeared, correct? You would do well to report this to Questa. Yes, sir. A beautiful area, but no one is active. Questa, I pray you come find me again. I have something to discuss. You never could sit still for lectures, but I promise not to interrupt your business. Come whenever you find the time. The very friendly old man. Master Fugo's right. I should talk to the mayor. Um, uh, yes, yeah, so... I... Hey there. There's only two quests for him, I believe. Get all the side quests ready to go, guys, because once we do start doing side, side questing, oh boy. Yes. It'll be a very slow process because so much needs to be done. We haven't done none. Uh... The good thing is, once we have more acquired, we can do them. Mm. Mm. Alright, go. Man, there's a lot of side questing in here. I didn't think there'd be so many for a town this tiny. And now it's dark outside, getting dark outside, guys. It's about eight. Yeah, it's probably about right. <laughs> so, everyone? Pretty much. Except for the one new town. That one should have been already acquired. And maybe I've already done it and it's just. Yeah. Yeah, it was him, I did. Oh, cool.
Right, so I need to buy idiot, not that way. Taking this? Oh, right, she's the mayor. Greetings, Val. We rarely have the chance to welcome the convoy, but it is our pleasure nonetheless. I assume you are here to deal with the Benevodon threat. Ah, she knows. On behalf of my people, I thank you for your assistance. Hang on. You knew about the Benevodon? Our patron elemental, Salamando, has made his own report. His request was simple. Hold out until the arms arrive. It grieves me to see you bereft of the arm of fire. Vel, please, tell me what happened to Hina. You know what? I inadvertently converted her essence into a core stone. Through your curious ability to crystallize living creatures, I presume. Where is her core stone now? Delophos, uh, a man who's trying to attack the goddess of mana, took her from me. But I'm gonna get her back. I won't let Delophos keep Hina's core stone. I will make sure her core stone is safe with me. I swear it. You don't need to convince me, Val. Stone or not, Hina has always been there. For you and Tiania both. If you need proof, look to Dorfer. So far, we have been spared from the worst of its recent agitation. The current unrest is surely due to the Benevodon. However, as the Soul Guard, you have a duty to tell Hina's parents the circumstances of their daughter's disappearance. I leave that to you, Val. Understood. I'll tell them. One more thing. You must enter Dorfer Volcano in order to reach Valkybel. Long ago, the leaders of our village felt it prudent to seal the entrance to the volcano, to avoid trespassers inciting the Benevodon's fury. Since then, we have kept it under lock and key, forbidding all entry into the sacred mountain from villagers and outsiders alike. But I will now entrust the key to you, Val. Please defeat the Benevodon for Hina, the Mana Goddess, and for us. Alright. Soul Guard and Arm of Light, our continued survival is in your hands. May the blessings of mana be with you. I promise. I will do my duty and protect the people. Good news for her, us. Tiania are with you. Make sure that you and the other. But once we make it up there, guys, it won't take long to get to it. And well rested before you leave. And be sure to speak with your own parents too. That's an order. You hear me, young man? I don't know if I should be listening to you because you're just a. You're a mayor, you don't have authority over me. Oh, right. Master Fugo wanted to talk to me. I should check in with him. Yes, he does, guys. We've got to talk to him. At first, we'll talk to our family. have a lot to catch up on and you all must be the ohms you look famished please come on in yes val come back when you two are done with your chat thanks mom you've matured on your trip i i have a great many things must have happened. Tell me about the journey. Okay. I lost... the most important person to me. I learned the devastating truth about our world, and now I have this weight of understanding pressing down on me. It's a heavy burden. 
The Benevadon threat and Dilophos's curse have to be dealt with. I... I have to fix it. I have to. But I'm only a boy from Tiania. Just Val. And... I don't know anymore. What am I supposed to do if I mess up? I could ruin everyone's future. All these thoughts are jumbled in my head and I just... don't know what to do. It would be a lie to say that I understand even a fraction of what you're going through, Val. As you know, my calling is metalworking. I make weapons and tools day in and day out. Simple as that. Only two things matter. The steel under my hammer and the hand that wields it. You need to trust yourself. You have made it this far. And you have a great many loyal friends Jay. to help you. There are as many ways to go through life as there are people on this planet. You may make the right decision and find that the result is not what you planned. What matters isn't choosing what is right, but following what your heart tells you. Following my own path. Besides, I could order you to do this or that. Or that. And we both know you wouldn't listen to me. Remember how I wanted you to take over the family business, but you were adamant about sword training with fugo well swinging around a sword sounded like way more fun than studying weapon making you see just val from t and nia you've always been able to figure out your own path without my help own your decisions and believe in yourself you know i'm lucky to have you for a dad stop you're making me blush I don't have an answer yet, but I won't get caught up in the doubt ever again. <laughs> that sounds more like my son. Can All right, can I... we head to the mountain now? This is kind of boring. Too much chit chatting. It feels as though I have not had such a fantastic feast in forever. The food here in Tiania is divine. Your mom can really cook. Maybe a little too piquant for my palate, but what do I know? Val, did you want to call on Hina's parents before we go? Well, I'm afraid those two aren't home at the moment. They needed to harvest some flower seeds before the volcano became too active. I did tell them it was dangerous, but they assured me they were fine. You can't win with that family. Sounds like the apple didn't fall far from the tree. Let's take on the Benevid on a fire inside Dorfer first. I promise to talk to Hina's family once we get back. You hear that, everyone? There's no room for failure. First, we take care of what we came to do. Then I can sit Hina's parents down and tell them everything after things have settled. I'm ready. Hmm. That sounds like a plan. There's no time to waste. Let's subdue the Benevidon and protect the village. I wish you all the best of luck. Go get that Benevimu what's it and show <laughs> it what the people of Tia Nia are made of. You know what? That's how I like to pronounce it the sometimes. The door for volcanoes should be a long charred passage. No time like the present. Yeah. So we're going to go there now, guys. And yeah, we're in that area. So the last area i got to unlock pretty much. Oh, yeah. Think of this, guys. We're in so what's close. Up? Now, let's fast travel through the shard area. Mm -hmm. All right, now that we've done that, guys, we can just make our way up there, get through the volcano. The volcano is very short, guys, so trust me, it's not that long. Once we do that, we're pretty much at the beginning of the end. Um, so good chance the next stream, guys, we'll be doing a lot of side questing. Uh -oh. I was thinking about doing it off camera. But I still want to do it for the stream, so I couldn't do it that way. Oh shit, that's right guys. Um remember how we said earlier on we what we'll do we'll come back to this area to collect everything? Uh, I better do that. I'm a, a bit later though, not this very moment. Such a plentiful meal prepared in so little time. Val's mother makes me a I was focused more on the taste actually. That's the volcano, right in front of us. 
Um, these enemies are not really challenging for me at all. Now that we're in the beginning of the area, I was also at Tower Right Death a Pain in the Ass. I will do it, but I won't be doing it today. I'll, like I said, I'll probably start doing some of them off, video, off camera. That one's a particular easy one if you know what you're doing. If you don't know what you're doing, it's a, an impossible one. Get going, guys. We're in the volcano area now, so... I'm enjoying myself, guys. I'm enjoying myself, especially now I'm playing back on the Minecraft. I've actually been uploading a few on that now. I noticed some of the numbers are starting to skyrocket, so I'm going to keep working. I'm going to keep doing that kind of stuff. Um, I mean, these guys are harder, but they're not that much harder. Alright, that's worth doing, guys. Actually, that's worth it. Oh, well, maybe not that much, but... Should be one over there. Let me see. Oh yeah, there's a fire one right here, guys. This is the last one. This is the last one we have to do. I totally forgot all about it, to be honest. Let's go in there, deal with it, and then that's it. The last one, guys. It's amazing how quickly it is to get these done out the way. Oh my god, 98! What the hell? Oh, but then again, I'm 94, so yeah, it makes sense, I guess. Huh. You can get two of these out of the way in one hit. Alright, that was easy, guys. I won them pretty quickly. Well, we'll keep the light one, too, guys, because we're in the fire area, so... Alright. Uh, I think I got a lot, guys. Thank you for Jen. For um, the luck, I do appreciate it. Yes. It's always nice to get a like for a stream. Uh, any more? Okay, it's this way. All right, let's go. Go. I wonder what a good idea to go in the in there. You don't know what the hell's in there. All right, let's go this way. We will come back and clear up this area as well at some point. Right after this boss. I'm all rested up and ready to beat some Benevidons into submission. We are well on our way to finishing with all the Benevidons. This will be our final fight. Please watch. Oh. Yahoo! Grizzly! Got some syrup. I'm nearly back to where we started. Correction, we are back to where we started. Alright. Let's go. Here, use this. 
Get going. All right, let's go. All right, we're not going in there. Let's get going. Oh, do this village out. It's right in front of it. Uh-huh. Go over here, grab this. And now we'll go inside the volcano. So I am not the only one worried about more than just the Benevidon around here, right? Tianians were never particularly scared of the volcano. It's just something we got used to. Oh, but keep an eye out for falling debris and ashes, of course. Dorfer's eruptions are just a part of life. We coexist peacefully, sort of. To each plant his own garden, as they say. Dorfer Volcano has always loomed over Tiania. Kind of like a protector of our village. Now that it's become volatile because of the Benevidon, I gotta do whatever I can to help. Well, that's settled then. Sounds like we have a date with some magma. All right, guys. We're in the volcano. How come this volcano is so hot? I've been around plenty of fires before, and it's never been this bad. This is a volcano. What do you expect it to be? Stifling. Almost as though our sweat evaporates the second our skin secretes it. Oh, you are in a volcano. What do you expect to happen? Be ice? Uh, Alms, where have you been? Ah, Salamando. Of course not. Oh, uh, this Benevidon is sure trying. There's barely any mana power for me to draw from. I'm running on fumes at this point. The lack of an arm is probably not helping either. That poor girl. <sighs> she didn't deserve to get her core stone stolen by Dalophos. Salamando, elemental of fire. You have my word that I will get your arm's core stone back. Cool your heels for a second, son. Has anyone ever told you that you're way too uptight? <laughs> Not in so many words. I just feel responsible for what's happened, so... You've got the same red-hot passion as Hina, and I like that. But what I want is action. Not wishy-washy promises. Yeah, well, it's not talking. Red-hot? Hina? Is my memory fuzzy or something? I said what I said! She was fiercely loyal, feverishly enthusiastic. She wanted to protect her village, fix the flow of mana, save the world, and stick with Val through thick and thin. I take it back. That's Hina to a T. Cut it out. My tears are going to dry up instantly in here. The only reason Volkido wasn't acting out earlier was because of Salamando's tireless efforts to hold it back. Ugh, I barely did anything. I just kept the cinders from the volcano down to a minimum. You did that for us? <sighs> Thank you, Salamando. Don't worry. The alms can take it from here. Is that all you got? Dig deep, Val. Once more, with feeling. <laughs> uh, the Benevidon of fire is toast. That's more like it. Keep going. And... Delafos is next. Yeah, let him know who's boss. Salamando still has plenty of steam left, if you ask me. Yeah, he's kind of, um... Gee whiz! I feel like I'm about to burn up in here. Don't joke. You're the most at risk in this place. It's 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 this. Yes. Trust me, anything that lives is at risk here. This is fire. Now, I mean, lava is... Oh, magma in this case. Very dangerous to anything that's living. Even not living. Is this? 
Uh, I don't really need that, but okay. But yeah, guys, this is the easy area to deal with. Not very long. Considering how powerful we are, we haven't even used any of our healing items for ages. Huh? Blue magma? I've never seen that before. Careful! Blue magma is much hotter than the typical red variety. You'll be burned to a crisp in an instant! The source of the cerulean lava is in several locations. If we were to obstruct it at its origin, we may be able to open a path. The vessel of water might be able to help. You bet it will. Undine will never let me live it down, but desperate times call for desperate measures. <sighs> Elemental infighting aside, we should head for the source of the magma. Well, we've got to do the left side, guys, because that's the easy one to deal with. Striking, but ominous. Yes. Take care not to be swayed by its sapphire glow. Thanks for the pick me up. Yeah, yeah, we know. It looks pretty, but it's dangerous. I mean, a lot of things in this world are like that, guys. The sun looks pretty, but trust me, if you went to it, you'll know about how dangerous it is. Actually, you wouldn't even make it to the sun. Barely make it past um, Mercury before you're feeling it. Alright, so we can get to the next level with 95, guys. We'll be really powerful. Um... Method of cooling the magma. Might as well try before we all melt into a puddle of all meat goo. Up there, I think. Okay, yeah. All right, let's go up. How did how that work? How do I slip off so badly? All right, here we go. In the volcano, guys. Grab this thing and see it lets me. Come on, let me grab the damn thing. Go! We only done this side of the volcano, guys. This side's not very difficult. Next side's a little bit longer. Actually, a lot longer, to be honest. Oh, yeah. Alright. There we go. I got chills from that brush with death. Chills? You mean burns, am I right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we have a job to do. Ah, <laughs> oh, boy. Really trying to... He's trying to lighten up the mood. But I think his jokes are pretty bad. Um... I hate when that happens. I'll put me, puts me back up here too. I have to do it all over again. But this time it's already broken, so... I can see where i got to go. There we are, guys. We're back here. Let's go to this side. This side's the longest. Not by much, to be honest. It's actually not that long, but watch your yeah. step here. It's a pool of magma. Those rocks don't look like they'll hold your weight for long. Better go quick. Oh, what makes it give that? Got some syrup. All right, guys. Um, yeah, these guys aren't that strong here. Yeah. Alright, uh, more enemies? Just let me pick these up. Shut up. Alright. 
11, oh, that's a lot of experience. Yes. All right, let's get going, guys. Yeah, really, I have not noticed. Oh, get a room, guys. That was easy to beat. All right, um, keep going this way. Thank for the lava, because it'll burn you. Actually, not as long as I expect it to be. Alright. I should shut that down. Nevadon of fire cause all this? Nah, the volcano is always like this. I see why the mayor kept this place locked up tight. Ah, so the volcano is always this active, huh? Okay, that makes sense. Oh boy, I don't like these things. Oh, that was fun. Um. Go downwards. Grizzly. Taking this? Yes, we are, but we're taking this more. This is kind of exciting. Is this? Help us out. Yahoo! Oh, yeah, it's nothing special here, guys. Grizzly. All right, that's the hardest part. Let's go. Let's smash up head. Yeah, I don't think he likes being here because it's lava and plants don't mix. With some help from Salamando, we should be able to proceed. The only relief I get in here is when we're right on that. Yahoo! Grizzly! Where am I going anyway? Up here, look at it. Okay, cool. Found my spot. Let's get off. All right, let's go. There is a enemy here, guys. A mini boss, as such. You know the usual stuff. But yeah, once we're done here, guys, I think we'll finish up because tomorrow we're doing the side questing, guys. We're going to be doing a lot of the side. Oh well, no, we're going to do some of the mission, then the side questing, and then yeah, and then we'll pretty much finish. So that's probably going to take a few more, another two videos, three videos tops. Oh, see how we go. Alright, oh, that bird looks familiar. It's a huge bird made of fire. Oh, I hate you. You're bothering me already. I want to beat you up so badly, it's not even funny. Ow. 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 Alright, here we go.
All right, let's beat him up. No, it's not. Right, it's right up against the wall, so... Alright. You're baiting for me. Goodbye. Another dead enemy. Alright guys, we're level 95. We're severely overpowered here. Yes, ma'am. I've got plenty of resources. I haven't used any resources for ages. Actually, I don't think I've used any at all. Let's go! Ow, I got attacked by you, huh? Yeah, they hurt me, guys. They do attack me, but they don't hurt me that much. Do that. Got some syrup. I'm guessing we're going up to the volcano. Not down here, huh? Grizzly. Yeah. All right. We'll save because you never know what's going to happen. Oh yeah, guys, look how fast we're going through this playtime. Not even 20, not even a whole day. That's good. I played this one, it took me days to play. This one took me a much shorter time. No sign of the Benevodon. Oh, he's here, don't you worry. wrong salamando you don't look so hot huh well without much mana power to fall back on i'm losing steam Holmes, don't go down without a fight careful or this volcano could blow out of control that's a lot of pressure salamando this is the final benevodon so we gotta see this through we can't lose i'm not gonna let hina down like that we will beat this yeah we will Oh, come Speak of the monster. Looks like our Benevodon friend has arrived. Hey, so this guy's really... Oh boy, here we go. I don't know how something that, like that survives in the lava. Even though I know he's a lava boss, but still. Well, technically a fire boss, but... Yeah, just wipe it out, guys. It's not even that hard. That's it. We're done. That was the quickest boss. That was faster than the previous boss. Previous mini boss, that is. Yeah, well, 95 guys were really overpowered. Um, I was expecting the new game plus to be different, but it's exactly the same. Unfortunately, sometimes it's going to be like that. Dorfer ought to settle down now too. That's a load off my back and my mind, for that matter. Thanks for everything you've done for us, Salamando. It ain't over yet. Don't forget about Delafos's curse. You still got work to do. Yes, we're aware. You're right. Delafos can't be ignored any longer. <laughs> That's the ticket. 
Your fighting spirit is hotter than Dorfer at its meanest. And don't you forget it. I'm impressed. That's all the Benevidons stopped in their tracks. I think it's time to regroup with the Alm of Darkness. Before that, there's something I need to do. I have to let the village know everything's okay. And talk to Hina's parents. Hey guys, so we're very close to the end of this game, finally. I mean, so side quest will take a while, but that's okay. Val, you and the arms have performed most admirably. Thank you for everything. You truly are a hero to us. Yes, guys, uh, back to normal. A hero? I just wanted to help my home. As long as I manage that, I'm glad. Will you make for the mana tree once more? Not yet. I still have unfinished business here in Tiania. I gotta stop off at Hina's. Just wait here for me, okay? Sure thing. Take your time. Please give her parents our warm regards. We'll be here. Alright, so we're gonna see her. It's not going to be easy for him, guys, because you don't know how she, they're going to react. I mean, any parent will react really badly, so I'd kind of not blame them. I hope her folks are home. And hopefully they've got no weapons or knives or anything in their hands, because that'll be bad. Alright, there we go. Let's talk to him, get this out the way, and then move on. Hi. It's been a while. Val, what a surprise. Welcome home. How was your trip to the mana tree? Oh, uh, not finished quite yet. Actually, I came here to talk to you two about something. Something serious. During our journey, Hina, she passed on. She what? But how? It was my fault. Protecting her was my responsibility and... Right, power. I... as good as killed her myself. Val. I am so sorry. Please, I'll accept any punishment. Just say it. Dorfer's behavior has been strange for a while now. I'd had a bad feeling about it from the start. Guess my gut was right. It's hard to put into words, but even though I was so happy for Hina and wished for her success on the pilgrimage, at the same time, she deserved to have a normal life just like everyone else. I understand, sir. After the festival, we were so very proud to see that Hina was chosen to be the Alm. No one in the village was more pleased on her behalf than we were when we saw her off on the journey. But after she left, our lives felt less... vibrant. I thought about her no matter what I did. I'd remember her laugh, her frustrations, her tears. Most of all, I'd remember her smile. That's when it hit me. I had wanted Hina to be in our lives forever. I suppose you don't always realize how important someone is until they're gone. Ma'am, I... Val, never doubt how much Hina wanted to be by your side. 
Days before the festival, Hina would ask us how long we thought the pilgrimage would take. How long until you'd return from the mana tree. She fretted over whether you might settle down in a different village after you were done, like Lakaza. Didn't she, dear? Once she was appointed as the Alm, she was up all night, excited for the journey ahead. She said traveling the world with you was like a dream come true. And that's why we're grateful that you were there for Hina. Thank you, Val. I thought... You two would never forgive me for what happened to her. <laughs> this is almost worse. I... I wish someone would treat me like the villain. Dude, you're not a villain. Val, listen to me. She isn't gone. Hina will always be with you in your heart. You carry her will. She lives on through your deeds. You ain't bored, guys. I'm gonna finish up soon. Both of you now. Couldn't have hours, it's not too bad. I mean, it'll be like nice in the future we could do more. to think of it, Val. I believe Hina left a letter for you before you set out on the pilgrimage. <laughs> a letter? For me? That's right. But when I asked where she put it, she said it was a secret between the two of you. Then she made us promise to tell you about the letter when you returned, and reminded us several times before your departure. Yeah, sounds like her. You leave it in the thicket outside of town? Oh, so that was your secret rendezvous spot, huh? You'd better get there fast before we find it first. Go on now. All right, Thanks. so I'll be sure to check. So yeah, guys, we have to finish up because what we'll be doing now is we'll be tomorrow. We'll be um, yeah. Gotta be the thicket outside the village. More than likely. I'm coming, Hina. So done there, guys. We'll finish up because tomorrow we're gonna be doing the main part and then the, the side questing stuff. Side questing might take a few a while, so that'll be good. I mean, I won't need to record for a while, which means it gives me a chance for the recording the streams to catch up to the recording, or the recording to catch up to the streams, whatever way you want to look at it. Ah, look at Fowl. She could have hit anywhere here. It's fine like she was here when we were looking for her before we left. This is where I first met Hina. I remember she was reading a book when I ran up. A monster had made it into the village, and I was trying to chase it off. I had only just started to learn swordsmanship at the time. I won, but Liza and Master Fugo still got mad at me. <laughs> I cried, but at least I managed to defeat the monster in the end. Oh yeah, that's her. Ah. I found it, Hina. Yep. That's her writing, all right. Dear Val, if you are reading this, then I'm sure you've safely returned home from the pilgrimage to the mana tree. If all went well, then I am now a part of the world's mana power. 
and watching over you. I decided to leave you this letter now that we've both fulfilled our duties. After all, if I know you, I'm sure you're feeling down about having to let me go to the mana tree. This way, you'll have a little something to remember me by. And read if you're ever feeling lonely. I can't help but wonder, as I sit here and write this down, how your life is gonna be 10, 20 years down the road. The only regret I have, now that I've been named the Elm, is that I won't be around to see it myself. Yeah, I know it's selfish of me to think like that. Val, just remember that you have friends you can rely on. People who support you in everything you do. I know you'll be okay, even when I'm gone. Just keep going. Try things you never thought you'd do. Meet people from faraway lands. There's no end to the adventures you will have. I love this beautiful, spirit-blessed world of ours. I love it because it's where we were born, and where my wonderful parents and everyone else we've met lives. Not to mention, it's where I met you, Val. So I'll leave you with this. The future is yours. All I want for you is to live your life in the way that's best for you. That's my wish. Love, Hina. Hmm. Hina always did know me too well. Better than anyone. I wish we could have been together in the end. This feeling probably won't ever disappear completely. But that's okay. I'll treasure it. I'll keep Hina with me. Wherever I go. Alright, I think that's enough of the um, sad story. Sorry for the wait. Let's head to Lagrazzo. Alright, guys, that's it. We are going to stop the um, recording. I might do some collecting um, before we finish up. Because I don't think we need to do this yet, guys. We've got a while before we actually need to do this. Um, no, we're not going there. I found a bit of myself that I've been missing. Now I can finally move forward. Come on. Um, there's the volcano. I don't want to go to the volcano. Ah, eh, why not? We'll just go in. We can just turn around. So yeah, guys, I'm going to finish the recording. Um, what I'm going to do now is basically just finish um side quests, start doing that, and do some of the um collecting. So yeah, I don't really need that on. 